वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल सो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस द इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन ऑफ द सब्जेक्ट बिजनेस स्टैटिस्टिक्स ऑफ थर्ड सेमिस्टर एंड उस्मानिया यूनिवर्सिटी फर्स्टली कमिंग बैक टू द सिलेबस पैटर्न में टोटल फाइव यूनिट्स यू पीपल आर हैविंग सो आई एम डिस्प्लेइंग द लेसन नेम्स ऑन द स्क्रीन सो एटी मार्क्स पेपर यू पीपल विल हैव ओके सो दैट एटी मार्क्स कंप्लीट पेपर विल बी कवर्ड फ्रॉम दिस फाइव चैप्टर्स ओनली ओके सो वॉट आर द इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग्स एवरीथिंग यू विल डिस्कस इन दिस वीडियो बिफोर दैट द क्वेश्चन पेपर पैटर्न एज यू नो इन पार्ट ए यूनिट टू अटैम्प्ट फाइव क्वेश्चन ईच कैरीज फोर मार्क्स एंड इन पार्ट बी यूनिट टू अटैम्प्ट फाइव क्वेश्चन ईच कैरीज ट्वेल्व मार्क्स एंड इन ईच क्वेश्चन यू विल हैव द इंटरनल चॉइस लाइक नाइन्थ क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम यूनिट नंबर वन टेंथ इज यूनिट नंबर टू लेवल्थ इज यूनिट नंबर थ्री राइट सो इन पार्ट ए मा वन टू एट क्वेश्चन दे विल गिव in that you need to attempt five questions so it includes theory as well as the problematic okay so business statistics is not a theoretical subject nor it is a problematic subject it is a combined of both theory as well as the problematic things okay so for four marks if you are writing theory means one and a half side paper you need to write it okay in part b ninth question to 13th question you will have here also one theory question and problematic question it will covered in this part b ma you need to attempt five questions and each question will have the internal choice okay so this is the complete question paper pattern you need to understand before getting into the preparation okay first and the foremost we will discuss the short important questions which will be helpful for your part a to score 20 marks in your final examination okay so if you are attempting problematic it will be okay if you are attempting theory means minimum one and a half side you need to write it okay from unit number 1 limitations of statistics definition of statistics distrust of statistics parts of table this four question is the most important and the repeated question out of this four questions we can expect one question in part a compulsory and from unit number 2 ma uh, problematic question you will get it from like diagrams and next you will have the pictogram and diagram versus graph what are the functions of diagram so these are the main three concepts you can you can expect in from unit number 2 as a theory in unit number 3 we are not having any theory questions for four marks ma complete problematic concepts they might ask in part a like calculation of combined mean harmonic mean geometric mean and deciles also like eighth decile they will ask you to calculate in fourth also you are not having any theory questions but part a all are the problematic concepts only you need to try understand it okay and from unit number 5 ma so types of correlation correlation these two questions are most important and repeated theoretical questions from unit number 5 rather than this they can ask the problematic question from the correlation and concurrent deviation now we will discuss the long questions ma unit number 1 completely theory compulsory there will be a question related to the statistics either they may ask important scope anything but statistics is compulsory in unit number 2 is a simple unit ma uh, like based on the problematic concepts only you are having like diagrams so here you will have ogive curve histogram simple bar diagram that one okay from unit number 3 learn the concept of arithmetic mean and median mode you can give it as a choice okay unit number 4 uh, karl pearson skewness and karl pearson a uh, coefficient of skewness and bowley skewness two topics you can learn it ma and from unit number 5 compulsory rank correlation and karl pearson correlation these are the problematic concepts unit number 3 unit number 4 unit number 5 is completely problematic ma okay i hope that you people are getting clarity i will explain the i will upload the explanation videos also let me know in the comment section whether you want it okay hope you guys like it thank you all